Metal Slug 2. All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Metal Slug 2 playthrough. And now I'm going to be doing this one of two ways here. So I'm going to be doing a, uh, a playthrough of this with audio commentary and a playthrough without. I actually had a, um, a uh, viewer of the channel here request that I give my commentary on the gameplay while I go through it. It was uh, Thomas Jenkins. And yeah, I'm more than happy to do that. So we're going to do that. So I'm playing this now. God. And so this is the original Metal Slug 2. And maybe some of you are aware, but this game was remade. Uh, and it was called Metal Slug X. And as you can see here, there's a ton of slowdown on this. Like, just awful. I don't know what is causing this, but... And this is on uh, an original Neo Geo AES. And the slowdown... Yeah, I know. I've played through this game before. I don't remember it being this fucking terrible. But yeah, this is pretty bad. Like, this is terrible. So... Okay, now it looks like it's alright again, but... I know Metal Slug X fixes a lot of these issues, and I, it's just an overall more polished game. But I'm gonna go through, I mean, eventually what I plan to do, and the reason I've been doing these is because these games are so fun. I just wanna do a playthrough of all of them, and then just, you know, put them all together, and just put them all into one long video, which I just thought would be kind of fun to do. And I might even consider doing like a, I don't know, the ones on the other consoles. I think there's one on Game Boy Advance. And I don't have the Neo Geo um, color, or the pocket color. But well, maybe could emulate that and get that on there too. I'm not sure. Maybe I will, maybe I won't. But, so as you can see though, I mean, obviously the graphics are awesome in this game, but this slowdown is atrocious. This is really terrible. Like, there's really no reason for this. Oh, okay. I'm just run and hit that. I still remember liking this game quite a bit, though. I just know that I like uh, Metal Slug X better. And I might go through that one next after this. Just because that would make the most sense. Maybe play through this one first and then play through that one. And, yep, and again, this is not like a vanilla playthrough. I'm definitely using cheats here. So, the cheats I've got, I've got the uh, Neo Geo AES here. And uh, I've got a UniBIOS installed on that, so I'm able to use cheats on the games I've got. So for this one, I've got Auto Fire enabled, which is awesome. Like, I can't even imagine playing these games without the Auto Fire. Because look at how easy this is. I just hit A, and the dude just goes. There's no reason that it... Like, right now, I literally would have to be pushing the button 100 times a second to be able to do this. And that's just not fun to me. I get it why they did that in the arcade, like it makes the game harder, and they want you to spend more money to beat it, but I'm playing at home, I want to just play this and enjoy it, so also Infinity Lives, no reason to go through the uh, continue screen every 5 seconds, because this game will kill the absolute shit out of you, like every 5 seconds, what the fuck is going on? Yeah, the slowdown on this one is just bonkers. This is really bad. This is worse than any of the other ones. Like, I don't even remember being this bad, but I know that the first one's not that bad. The third one and the fourth one were definitely not this bad, so... Something, man, is how they were programming this or what. They, they weren't on top of their game with this one. I do remember this game being super fun, though. But still, I just know that Neo, or, uh, Metal Slug X is a lot better. What the fuck? This is almost like cheating. This is like having a cheat mode on itself, like having this much slowdown. Can I bomb this? Grenades up your asshole. Grenades! There it goes. 
So that's cool though. You know, the, the big selling point on these games is just how detailed the graphics are. Like, even though this game's running like pure shit, like, and it is, this is fucking terrible. This is horrible. Mission complete. The, just the detail on these games is insane. If I had one of these at the same time, like I had a Super Nintendo as a kid, this would have just blown my mind. There we go. Right in there. Oh, God. So I think this is the game where they introduce the zombies. Yeah, I think it is. And I think uh, this game really just kind of goes all out with the zombie. Yeah. Oh, it does. doesn't make it bad just they kind of overdo it you just get turned into a zombie a lot sort of like when you get turned into the fat guy it's cute like the first one or two times but after that you're just sort of like all right enough of that dude a fucking trap let me go oh yeah i can't go in there all right i thought we had uh branching paths there but i guess not See, I think this starting stage here, they're going to try to turn me into a zombie as much as they can because it's like a new concept. By zombie, I mean like mummy, whatever. It's the same thing. They turn into a, a zombie in the later ones. I just, you know, I can't say it enough to like how much I love how these games look. Remember, there was like a bowling alley that was by me when I was growing up, and it was called Starlight Lanes. And of course, every bowling alley that's worth the shit, like they had an arcade in it. They always did, and they had one of these Neo Geo arcade machines in it. So it would alternate between one of the Metal Slug games or, um, oh fuck, what was the Oh, God damn it. I just got turned into the mummy. Yeah, of course. Whatever. And then they had uh, the... Um, oh, fuck. What's the baseball one called? There it goes. There's, I think that's my first death, by the way. That's not bad for one of these games. But, yeah. And then they had the... Uh, oh, I think it's called All-Stars Baseball. Which is awesome. And I was... You know what? I actually kind of plan on doing a review of that one. I just wanted to hold off on Neo Geo for a second. Just because I got to do something else. I got to... So I hit uh, turbo graphic or PC engine, whatever. And uh, now I feel like I gotta do a GameCube game. Like I gotta take advantage of that. I gotta do a GameCube game. Then after that, maybe I'll come back to a Neo Geo game and hit All-Stars Baseball. And those games are, I mean, All-Stars Baseball, I hate sports so much, but God damn, it's just like Neo Geo just does everything super awesome. And All-Stars Baseball was one I remember playing in that arcade at that bowling alley and just fucking loving it. It was awesome. And I know it was also one of these uh, Metal Slug games too. Playing one of those, that's the first time I saw it. And I never could have had any idea at that time that you could have just been playing that at home. Zip, fuck you, mummy. Fucking mummies, fucking pain in the ass. Shotgun your ass. Wait, what's happening? I know now, I might be crazy. Maybe I'm getting better at these games, but I don't feel like that's the case. I kind of feel like uh, maybe this game is actually easier than... Oh, God. Oh, God. This game seems a little bit easier than the last ones that I played. The other ones seem like very content, just killing you every five seconds. This one, I've survived pretty good. Usually these games are really, really hard. This one doesn't seem that hard so far. Maybe they fixed that in Metal Slug X, because you're kind of just, all right. All right, I remember this. I know this boss too. I'm gonna fight on this thing. I think it's a big like snake or something that comes up from the bottom and you kill it with this thing. Yeah, okay, so it's a big machine. There you go. This thing's probably gonna kill me quite a bit. This game is designed to take all your money, so. If it's not doing that, it's not doing its job, apparently. Fuck, this thing is hard to control. 
And the slowdown here is just absolutely nuts. I don't know. And can I throw bombs? Yep, I can. This guy's got bombs. Shit. 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 Do I still have bombs? Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Get out of there. Get out of there. Yep, so I still got some bombs. I'm throwing them. Oh my god, though. This game. Alright, this is moving so, so clunky, though. This is just. Alright, there goes that. Oh, nice. And I got 10 bombs back. Let's just chuck them all. Go nuts. Killed it. Not bad. I didn't die once. For sure, this game is giving me a much, e much easier time than the other ones. Mission complete. You guys cooking some stuff. Get your uh, blonde haired guy back or whatever. Oh, see, now the game's running at full speed now. Maybe this game just didn't like the mummy level. I don't know. It's something about that. Just have no idea how that got by, like, testing, but. Die, motherfucker. Die. Die. Oh, and uh, also, by the way. I've got uh, my console set to the Japanese region, so that way you get the blood. If you play this on the American version, you get sweat, which is just fucking stupid. But I guess just what companies felt like they had to do back in the 90s, because America and whatever was just so dumb about video game violence, even though we're the ones that made Mortal Kombat. America is the one that brought you guys Mortal Kombat. It's like the most violent game fucking ever. At least now it is. It doesn't get any crazier than that. This slowdown is nuts. Holy shit. What is this? It look, it got, if this were like the 2000, if it was 2022 right now, I'd be blaming this on a memory leak because that's what people love doing. Guys, I think this game's got a memory leak. running like shit it's got a memory leak so we, do we get guys we got to patch this memory leak it's making the game run like garbage well this boss is kind of cool though and like look at, again look at this though like look at these backgrounds all of this looks fucking awesome so you're on a moving train you got these dudes that, oh shit oh shit what oh fuck all right, sorry guys, that was, uh, that was me sucking ass right there. I just had my finger on the bomb button and not the fire button like an idiot. That's what happens. And Well, it's not really the heat of the moment since everything is happening in slow motion, so I got plenty of time to plan out my strategy here. Jump right over that. Just jump over that. Jump right over that shit. Oh, fuck. I died for 10 seconds. God, I really wish this game... I don't remember this game running this poorly. Holy shit. Uh, well, it's still... There's good things I can say about it, though. I mean, look, these graphics are still incredible from when this game came out. I, I'm not exactly sure of the year this came out, but... I know it, it might have been like 94, 95, maybe 96. I'm not sure. But still, like, guys, this game looks fucking incredible. Just like every other Neo Geo, Neo Geo game. I love this console a lot. This is fucking worth every fucking penny I paid for it. I don't know what this thing's doing though. What, they're throwing these little balls at me. I don't want these. Don't worry guys. I mean, if everything's gonna be in slow motion, it's not gonna be that hard to fucking win. Whoop. All right. Cleared that, no problem. All right, well, I can't. Man, maybe I should've just skipped this one and went to, I don't know. Really, just for continuities. Oh, well, he still got me. Continuity's sake, man, I should still play through uh, the second one here, and and then just play Axe afterwards. And God, well, fuck it, they're still killing me. So whatever. Yeah, then just play through Axe, and then just show how much better it is. I mean, there's a reason they decided to release that one, which is just an update of this one. They knew they fucked up on this one. I just don't know how this got released in this condition. Like, what the fuck? 
And then there's later ones in the series that look better than this, that play way better than this, that don't have this slowdown. So yeah, this was just, they are just probably pushing this one out. They saw the first one did really well and they were like, all right, let's, we gotta get this one out ASAP. We gotta fight the Nintendo 64, dude. 3D graphics are killing us. Yeah, well, those games look like shit compared to these. But yeah, that's I stand by that statement too. These games just look way, way better than those three 3D, 3D games at the time. Like way, way better. And these look awesome. I mean, this one doesn't play awesome. It kind of plays like fucking garbage. You get my point. See where I'm going with that. Like, look at this boss. Look at this thing. I'm gonna stop shooting for a minute. Look at this. Like, just look at the detail on this. Imagine just having a Super Nintendo at the time, and then just seeing this, like, on your home console. I don't know. I, the whole thing, the, the whole Neo Geo thing to me just seems insane. Fuck, how did he kill me? Fuck you, dude. Neo Geo just seems fucking crazy to me because these games are outrageous for the time they came out. Nothing came close. And I still think that these are still some of the best. I think a lot of uh, new games these days strive to look like this. What is this? What are you? Move faster! God damn, dude, this is like... Oh my god. Some sloppy shit. I don't even... Why do I have a... Alright, you know what? Who cares? I don't know. I don't know. I. Anyway, to be honest though, yeah, I don't remember this being that bad. And it's so fucking bad, like, it's really all I can talk about. Like, dude, this slowdown's fucking terrible. Alright, I can't wait to just play. Ne uh, why do I keep saying Neo Geo X? Which is a shitty console they released. Met Metal Slug X. Because this is so bad. This is the fucking worst. I've never played a game with this much slowdown in my entire life. What the hell? Did I beat it? I can't even tell. It's moving so slow. Oh, there. Okay. Mission complete. Mission three complete. There we go. Mission four. Start. What is this little dude? Who are you? Hey, little guy. What are you doing? Hey, what is happening? Oh. What are you doing? What are you yelling at? We're in a war zone, dude. <laughs> what a dick. All right. I don't want to shit on this game too much. You know, in my treasure review, where I reviewed a bunch of treasure games, I'm kind of glad I didn't pick this one to look at. Because I feel like if I did, I would have actually had some complaints to make. And from what I remember, though, this is the only... Is that a pile of shit? Did I just pick up a pile of shit? I don't know. It looked like a pile of shit to me, but... I think this might be the only Metal Slug game that you can complain about. Like, this slowdown sucks. And I know I keep talking about it, but I mean, if you're watching the video, like, dude, give me a fucking break. Like, this is terrible. And I think it's the only game that really does this like this, so this was just a monumental mistake. And they did fix it with Metal Slug X, and we'll get to that. Oh, oh, no. So, yeah, we got the Fatso guy here. All right. I didn't think they did that in this game. I thought it was just the mummy stuff, but yeah, we got Fatso. And then, yeah, it looks fire in the fat bullets, too. Fuck you, dude. There's... Oh, I don't have grenades. Shit. Just vaporized my fat guy. Not that it matters. My normal guy moves just as slow, man. Fuck you. Oh, shit. I'm fat again. How did I get fat again? What the fuck? I didn't eat anything. How did you get fat so fast? How did I die? I have no idea. So you can see too, uh, like look at that. Look at the animation on that truck, by the way. Did you see that? Look at that thing going, look at that. That's fucking awesome. Okay. 
okay. I don't know, you can tell that the developers here and the animators, they spent a lot of time on this game, like, just over the little details. Like, look at this, two guys talking, that guy, that guy. Look at that, there's a plane taking off in the background. Why is that there? Doesn't matter. It's fucking awesome. Look at this guy. The, you know, my slaves up here. Fuck you, dude. Fuck you, man. Fuck you, man. And kill you. These things, uh, guns are kind of hard to control. I, I'm not really for Like, it's hard to move and control the guns at the same time. Best thing to do is just, like, go as nuts as you can. Use all your bombs. Get that shit out because you're gonna die, like, fast. That's what happens. Once you get in a vehicle, you die like pretty quick, so just use all the firepower it's got as fast as you can. Some good shit. Bomb, 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 bomb. Get it. Dead. Trucks. I mean, these trucks look cool, but it's slowing down the game. I can tell it's these trucks doing it. Like this. Bomb. I don't have any more bombs, so... Oh yeah, though. You know what? Everything I just said is a lie because now I'm kicking ass in this thing. So, this is the Metal Slug, by the way. That's uh, where it gets its name. What the game gets its name from. Like, yeah, see, look at this thing. This thing looks awesome! Good lord. Yeah, this thing looks fucking awesome. Awesome detail on this fucking shit, dude, for real. I thought I wish I had fucking bullets in my cannon, but I guess not, but let's go nuts here. Let's fuck this thing up. What? What the fuck? Nothing hit me. Alright, fine. Well, nothing hit me, but my metal slug had to explode anyway. It just didn't like the overpower it gave me, I guess. I only have that for so long. And quite frankly, I'm probably dumb and something probably did hit me and I'm just being, whoa. Alright, that thing looks huge. Let's just not do that. No, we don't need that. That's cool. Yeah, that's that's awesome, whatever that is. And I can't remember. I don't think there's, like, aliens in this one. I know that... I think it, it was the next one, right? Where it introduces aliens that are trying to do something different. I think this one you're still, like, fighting the quote-unquote Nazis. See, the way this game moves so slow, too, is it's like, I'm kind of kicking this game's ass. I wouldn't have even had to use a continue yet at this point, and that's unheard of. Like, in the other Metal Slugs, I have to use continues, like, I don't know, on the first level. I die so often. I never said I was good at these games, I just said I love them. Alright, there's a difference. I'm not awesome at running guns here, but I do love this one. Not this one in particular, but this series. This might be the worst one out of all of them, I think. Yeah, this one. Oh, that one got me. There we go. And yeah, this this might be the worst one out of all of them, just because it plays so fucking bad. Like, again, I know that they remade it for a reason, and it's not because it was good. Mission complete. And so, I assume, got two more missions to go here. On a city. I mean, it's like, look at that. If you just, oh shit, I didn't even see that bullet. If you just look at the backgrounds here too, it's like, I don't know, there's, there's something here. I mean, obviously this is overpowering the fuck out of my Neo Geo, but. I mean, just look at look at those backgrounds. Coffee, pop shop. And I wouldn't be surprised if that's the only time we see those two um, those two awnings in this game. Like, everything is so unique. So original. I don't know. These, these games just there's a lot more attention to detail put into them. Got a, a turtle on that truck that says S line. But yeah, maybe we'll see that again in future games, but Look at that, and when the, did you guys see that? The helicopter just fired a bunch of fucking shots. And then afterwards, a bunch of shells flung out. Stuff like that is just very impressive to me. Watch this, maybe you can see it again. See that? 
and, the sh and then the shells fly out afterwards. You can see the gun or the turrets actually open up like uh, before it fires. Uh, that one's gonna hit me. Like you can see them open them up, like open up the tor the turrets, and the I can't fucking talk. Yeah, the turrets, and then they fire. Like stuff like that, man. That's insane. Shit that you would never ever see during this time period. And this is like we're talking Super Nintendo era. Maybe Nintendo 64 or PlayStation, but even these games were like hard to play on those consoles. Or like on a PlayStation. Or what was it, Saturn? I think it was PlayStation. PlayStation got this and it had a hard time playing it. And I think Saturn could play it. But still. I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. Whatever. Just let me focus here. I'm just not paying attention. I'm just talking and playing for, for minutes. Now it's getting a little fucking intense here. There's a bunch of pigs walking around. The game's finally getting harder. I don't know how many continues out of you so far. I'm thinking maybe one or two, which is still nuts. Like, I'm more than halfway through the game now. And that's crazy because the other games kill you so fast. This one is just so slow, it can't even, can't even be bothered to kill you. Go in that tunnel, motherfucker. Hey, what's up? I'm some chick tiptoeing around. What are you doing? I don't know, what are you doing? Why are you doing that? Okay, hit this helicopter. Oh, I got a laser. Boom. Fuck you up. Fuck you up, laser. You too, bitch. Oh, God, laser's really strong. How about I bomb you? You want me to knife you? How about that? Hell yeah. Oh, come on. Get, get it out of here. Get out of here with that. Nope, not today, dude. Okay, yep, they're really trying now. They're they're definitely trying to stop me. All right, I don't know. Maybe it would have been a couple continues, but still, at this point, I've I would have only spent a couple of bucks, and I still think for a Metal Slug game that's outrageous. Like, did you see me dodge those bullets? In normal games, I would not be able to dodge those. It just would have been too hard. And you know what's fucked up, man? Is I'm really good at bullet hell shooters, though. That's, I think, what's weird. Fuck. If I wouldn't have jumped there, I wouldn't have died. Like, bullet hell shoot em ups, I'm, like, awesome at those. Like, for the most part. Eh, I would say I suck at them, but I'm actually generally pretty good. And it's like, for some reason, these games, though, I can't dodge bullets for shit. Ah, you fucker! What are you doing? Why are you hopping around like assholes? What is your problem? Fucking die, helicopters. Time to go, guys. This is, you guys have overstayed your welcome by a lot. It's time to go. Time to go. Are you seriously gonna do this forever? Time to go, time to go. See, and this is why, if I didn't have auto fire, this would just be the worst. That would have went on for like another 10 minutes. So it's like, guys, if you're gonna buy a Neo Geo, just, you gotta just do what it takes to get the UniBios. Just install it, get it. Throw bombs at this thing. A train coming at you, you can shoot it. You can shoot a train to death, I guess. Got a tank here. And yeah, like, I get it, this might be cheating. I just don't give a shit, man. I don't know if I can play these games and enjoy them. You know, it's like, I never really liked these bunker type levels like every metal slug seems to have these where you're all underground or you're in a closed off space i just never like this as much as i do with the open areas like the open areas they do they're always like fucking like seriously they're like gorgeous like they look awesome you got like waterfalls in the background you got like mountains and cliffs tanks driving over them and shit like uh, what that one level or okay well done man you got that one level that I was just at where you got the uh, fucking like airplane flying overhead. That shit's pretty awesome. And I don't know why this these games do insist on always doing these underground bunker levels. Like, they just don't look as good. I don't know. I do think uh, maybe they switched this up. I know I've played through uh, like what, Metal Slug 5. I honestly can't even remember if there's a Metal Slug 6. I'm pretty sure there is. I think it goes up to Metal Slug 6, but it might just be 5. But one of them I know is like uh, a lot of jungle or whatever. 
And uh, that's awesome. It's like they realize people don't want to have these claustrophobic, like, shitty environments here. Like, look at this. Come on. I gotta sit here and do this. Fuck off. Well, now after this, I'm kind of excited to just check out Metal Slug X again because this is. This is kind of where the rapid fire is cheap, but fuck that. This whole scene is cheap. Time to die, motherfuckers! Ready from the sky, got these fuckers. Here comes the train, holy shit, what the fuck? Dude, get out of here, train. 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 The hell? Okay, well someone please tell me how if I didn't have rapid fire, any of that would have been possible, because that would have been impossible. Whoop. Sorry, buddies. Eh, yeah, well, you did your best. Here we go. <laughs> See, awesome backgrounds too right there. I wonder if it's like that in the American version. I wouldn't be surprised if it's not. What is this? What do you want, dude? Wait. Oh. What the fuck is that thing pointing down? What, what do you want? Oh, yeah. All right, I remember this. Yep, we got these aliens now. And these things suck. Are these the ones that explode too? Like in the... What is it, the third one that they do this? Yeah, they start blinking and then they explode. If they're by you, they kill you. Oh my god. That's not what any of us need. We don't need this shit. Although I do like in the third one, I believe it's the third one, where it's got like the, uh, the shmup. Turns into the shmup shit, the bullet hell. Well, it's not really bullet hell, but... Just like a shooter. I think they actually do a really good job at that. It plays out pretty well. And if you can tell if you watched that one, it's the last last one I put out. It's the Metal Slug 3 video that I put out. Now you can tell I die a thousand times in that game and then once it turns into the shmup portion of the game, I actually do really well and I hardly ever die. So again, weird thing like just mixing those two genres of games together. You can tell I'm terrible at these running guns, but awesome at those other bullet hell type of games. Okay, this fucking sucks, dude. This is like playing at 15 frames per second. This is terrible. Yeah, I like the way the game looks, but... I just don't understand how this is programmed so poorly. Like, what the fuck, man? Who did this? Did they let Atari develop this? What the fuck is this? Die. Now, if I didn't have auto fire, that would have taken me fucking four hours to blast through that fucking cage. Like, get out of here, you red freaks. What are you get what are you doing? Get out of here, tank. What are they doing shooting me, man? Shoot the fucking monsters. Don't waste your I hope you feel good about that. We have a common enemy, you know. There's monsters down here, dude. Oh, God, there's another one. There's three in a row. All right, whatever. Bomb, you're dead. I'll fuck you. Fuck you up. This is what happens, Larry. See what happens, Larry? You see what happens, Larry, when you fuck a stranger in the ass. All right, I remember this. Three bombs, you gotta use those motherfuckers. Yeah, use your bombs, cause you're gonna die a lot at these bosses. So, here's my hot tip to you, man. Use bombs every second you have them at a boss in this game. Because bosses are designed to murder you every five seconds. So every five seconds, you can just rattle off like five bombs or whatever, fucking do it. Although this one, you can probably last a lot longer because the game keeps going in slow motion, so it's easy as hell. Look at this. Like, where do I go? Well, we're going to dodge that. 
no problem because it's like fucking cheating here with the game going this slow oh okay well that one got me so one got me and now i've got 10 bombs boom here we go use all of them do not fuck it don't well don't throw them away from the boss like i just did but use all of them on the boss at all times there what the fuck is that i did not see that coming glad that didn't hit me because i just didn't see that coming i will say too like this is i guess one problem i have with these games is the boss fights go for way too long and there's no boss meter which i guess kind of drives me nuts i want to know how much more i have to go to kill the boss i deserve to know otherwise it's like how do i know the game's just not making it up as it goes like Oh, uh, yeah, fuck it. Well, you haven't died yet. So now this boss is gonna take four times as long like nah, man Give me a health meter. I deserve to know like how much more I need to hit this boss oh, Well, there he goes got it Final mission. Here we go. I still don't know why these is. Why are these guys attacking me? We just established. Okay, I'm an ice cube. Wait, wait. Did that kill me? What the fuck? How was I supposed to know that? Look at this slowdown. Oh my god. What is happening? What do I do with this? Oh my god. Alright, so yeah, it's official. So next next one we're gonna upload is metal metal slug x just because we need an instant comparison i know it's not nearly this bad i remember memble sorry i'm i'm drinking it's starting to get to me here but i remember playing metal slug x though and it not being anything like this so this is just outrageous oh my god Can we, can we not, guys? Okay. Fuck you, dude. You want some bombs? Eat some bombs, bitch. Eat them. Show them up your asshole. Yeah, you want bombs? Do you like flying through the air? Eat some bombs. Do that. Fuck you. Dude, what is this? That crazy bridge in Italy or whatever that blew apart in the wind? What is this? Well, I actually think that was in America, but still. What is this? This is crazy. This actually looks awesome, but I actually love that they did this. This kicks ass. Obviously, though, the system can't handle this. It can. It's just this is programmed poorly. They released it anyway. Why would they do this? Oh, here's this guy. Oh, okay. All right. That was fair. Guys, so now here's my hot tip. Use all your bombs. Use every bomb. I mean, try to hit them with them, though. Like, unlike what, what I just did. Use your bombs. Hit them with it. Because he's going to kill you. Holy shit. All right. Okay. All right, then. Let's move on from that. No problem. Uh, and for the record, I liked all of that. So that guy that comes out and talks a lot of shit, he was just easily murdered, and then he was just eaten by an orca whale. That's cool, dude. Fuck, I don't know what hit me. I didn't see any bullets, but whatever. Maybe they were moving so slow that they just refused to register on the screen. It's like they move so slow you can't even see them. All right, fuck you guys. There's some bombs. Fuck it. Yeah, keep doing that. You got it. Let's. Yup. Close. There you go. Close. Close, man. Where are you going, dude?
Shields can't stop my knife. Knife, 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 die. Oh yeah, so there's these puke aliens and shit in this. You fucker, what are you attacking me for, dude? Aliens exist, leave me alone. We need to fight our common enemy. Get the fuck out of here, dude. I don't get it. Where are these guys coming from? Where was that alien just at? How did it get past all these guys? You know what? It doesn't matter. So we're like underground again. Yeah, that's kind of like a bummer a little bit. I'd rather we weren't. But it's still like the stage looks really good still. Like look at that. See that hand-drawn art in the background like that submarine? That's like pretty kick-ass. I like that. I don't understand. Like, these aliens are part of it now, and I think they're the main enemy from the third one. I think that's the whole deal with that one. Give me that. Fucker. Give me that. Give it. Set fuckers on fire, dude. Burn them. Time to die. Time to die. Don't worry, guys. It's going so slow. Well, I was just going to say you can't kill me, but yeah, you still can. Oh, still, regardless, these graphics are awesome. Still looks really good. Got that amoeba floating around. These aliens, I don't like these aliens as much. Uh, a lot of times, I kind of wish that they would have just stuck with human enemies as the bosses, but, you know, I give them respect. They were trying to do something different. And, I mean, in the third one, you got, like, a lot of the shmup stuff, which was actually pretty awesome. Uh, some of it went on for way too long, because, again, it's just trying to take your quarters, but... I mean, ultimately, though, the... All right. I don't know what hit me, but... This alien shit, it just gets too fucking weird. I don't know why. Maybe it's alien. I, I have no idea. It's like the other day, I just watched Prometheus. And I'll just say, like, uh, I actually like that movie a lot more than I did the first time I saw it. But then after that, I watched Alien Covenant, and that movie wasn't that good. I thought maybe I'd like it again. I'm a big fan of the Alien franchise, but I just didn't. It wasn't that great. It's just a movie that exists. Uh, and what does that have to do with this? Well, I'm fighting aliens, and what the fuck killed me, man? Like, what even hit me? Free that slave. Free him. It is, there's just too much garbage. Like, what is going on on screen? There's like amoebas. Okay. There's like amoebas floating around. There's red ones. There's gray ones. There's, oh, there's that. There's ones that have guns. Why do you need guns when you can puke fucking shit that kills me? Why do you need that? You got amoebas that go all over? All right. What is this? It's like Scientology, the video game here. Who am I fighting? So these are all Xenu. Yeah, get those thetans out of my face, dude. Get the shit out of here. Get it out. Oh, and that guy just fell from space. Landed on his ass. He's alright. No worries, guys. Don't worry about that guy. Prisoner of war, man. These aliens... What killed me there? I'm about ready to make this stop. Can't wait to check out uh, Metal Slug X after this one. I feel like the comparison is going to be night and day. I feel like this one's going to be the clear loser in that battle. Alright, cool. Cool, cool, cool. Get it. Can we not do those amoebas? Alright, thank you. Okay, fine. I'll bomb those fuckers. I don't care. And do it. Let's get out of here. Die. Come on, man. What is this? Space invaders? Get out of here. Fuck out. Get the fuck out of here. Easter, goddammit. I don't need this shit. Okay. Alright. Cool. Cool. Oh, can I finally move on? Thanks, dude. Thanks for that.
Oh, they're working together. Okay, I get it. And then the third one, they're not. Okay, I get it. And I take all of that back. They are clearly not working together. So... I, uh... I made a mistake there with that assumption. Oh my god, look at that, though. The animation on that, on that ship. That's fucking awesome. That looks really good. Look at that. I'll stop shooting. Look yeah, at these little dudes. Oh, well... Okay, well... You know what? It was worth it for you guys to just look at that. Look at that shit. Look at that. That looks fucking amazing. And then you guys in the ship. That looks really good. No joking about that. And remember what I said. Use all your bombs. Grab this pig. You guys also just always grab the pigs. I don't know why, but you want them. Grab those pigs. Okay. And use all your bombs. Use them all. Get a boss fight. Use your bombs. Now my bombs are gone. Now you can die a happy man. That's what you need. Fuck, I wish I had more bombs. Fuck, I wish I had more bombs. You know what I'd like to see too? Is I guess if you guys are watching this, I got bombs back. Like, check and see if anyone's beaten this uh, on one... See if anyone's beat this on one credit. I bet some fucking crazy motherfucker out there has. No, not just one credit. I mean, uh, god damn it. I meant like uh, one life. I would love to see if someone just beats this with one life. That would be insane. Like, no death. If you can beat this, no death, you are the shit. Goes. Down she goes. And again, as you can see, I mean, all the detail in this is insane. Look at the whole city and fire on the background. So you just saw that mothership just pick up that smaller ship. You see these uh, little aliens flying around. You see the war going on in the background. Like, all of this is absolutely fucking bonkers. Like, God damn it. And it still looks really, really good to this day. I mean, this shit holds up really, really well. And uh, not a lot of games do like that, especially not from this era. And you're competing with Nintendo 64, PlayStation. I know I probably already said that like five different times, but it's important, man. I mean, seriously, because this, this shit holds up and it looks fucking awesome. And without the slowdown, if this came out today, this game would just be fucking amazing. Like, no one would think twice about this. This would fit right in today and that's what 2d games do they work no matter what they look fucking awesome and this is impossible to fucking play this is so hard to play i have no idea what's going on like look at this what is happening what am i shooting at controls like fucking garbage But, all right, I guess I'm gonna eject from that. I don't know what else to do. I don't even know if I even hit anything with that. Thanks. Okay. And, and look, this is uh, another thing I'll complain about with metal slugs. And this game is particularly bad. Like, I don't think I've really complained about any of the other ones I've played. Like I am with this one. This one is plagued with problems. I. See this shit? I just don't know what the fuck is going on. I can't control this guy. And I know I probably die a lot, a lot more in the other ones. But at least it's cohesive. I know what the fuck is going on. Like, I'm just getting... 
getting my ass kicked because I am just not good at the game. But this one, I don't know what the fuck is going on. It's so slow. It's got so much slowdown. I'm just constantly dying, and it just kind of sucks. Like, I don't know. Oh, look at this. This is definitely an Independence Day reference. Boom, there it is. I think that's the end. Anyway, yeah, th this one it was okay. It was fun, but I know there's no. It sucks playing through this one, knowing that there's another version of this exact game out there that's done better. So it's like playing through this one's kind of a, a slog. It's almost like a waste of time. We'll take a look at next one I do. I'll do the Metal Slug X. That should make the most sense. I mean, since I'm working down from four anyway, so I did four or three. Mission now this one, complete. we'll do X next, then one, and we'll go up. There it is. Mission all over. Fun stuff. So there it is. Like, I know I, I fucking jizz all over the other ones, and I, I really love every other one, even like the one before this, Metal Slug 1 is awesome. I don't know what happened to this one. I don't know why it's so fucked up, but it is, but it's still really fun. That was still really fun. It just kind of sucked. Metal Slug X is better, but we'll be taking a look at the rest of them too, and we'll just do that later. But for the most part, guys, enjoy the credits, whatever, and then I'll see you guys on the next video.